Dengue fever is a flu-like illness and can cause intense joint pain in severe cases. The Ministry of Public Health has warned Thais to be aware of the dengue fever outbreak. First case of dengue fever for the season. Central America is battling one of its worst ever. Dengue fever, caused by a bite from an infected mosquito, it's known as breakbone fever. Symptoms include sickness and fever, extreme joint pain, and in severe cases, bleeding from the eyes and nose. According to the World Health Organization, there are 50 to 100 million cases of dengue fever every year, and for thousands of people, it is fatal. Currently, there is no cure and no vaccine. I contracted dengue from mosquitoes around my apartment. I had a lot of pain in my bones, particularly. It felt like someone was hammering at my bones constantly. Uh, I would wake up screaming in the night. The pain was so intense. Originally from Africa, the dengue mosquito has invaded more than 100 countries in the last 50 years. This is a jungle mosquito and a jungle virus that has moved to the urban jungle. And we helped it by, by essentially transporting it all around the world. There have been recent outbreaks in Brazil, Mexico, and the Caribbean. And every year, it is spreading. The culprit for spreading dengue fever is the Aedes aegypti mosquito. We spoke to a male and a female. Hades aegypta, thanks for agreeing to be filmed. Not at all, darling. Come a little closer. I won't bite. <laughs> so, this is your home? Yes, isn't it perfect, darling? I just moved from the plant pot in the hallway to be closer to my delicious family. <laughs> of course, Aid here doesn't partake. He's a veggie. Honestly, call yourself a mosquito. Well, um... Hades just follows me around. It's the only thing he's good at. Have you heard of dengue fever? Darling, I feed, I mate, I lay eggs. I'll bite you whether you're sick or not. If that means I pass your horrid little disease on to the next person, it's not my problem. But you do realise that's why humans spray chemicals and fogs, because of you. Darling, I know. It's all about me. <laughs> oh, you explain, Aid. I can't be bothered. Um, well, humans have been using fogs to try and kill us for 50 years, and it does kill other insects. But we're getting used to it now. Besides, humans don't like fogging their own homes, so we're safe in here. What about the Oxitec method? What's that? Another useless attempt to get rid of us? And take a look for yourself. In the UK, Oxitec scientists have found a new way to control the dengue mosquito. The Oxitec solution is based on the fact that we have produced a strain of mosquitoes. Now these ones carry specific DNA so that when they mate with females, the offspring do not survive. So we release males into the environment. All of these males carry this DNA. They will seek out and find females, and there won't be any offspring. The female cannot tell the difference between an Oxitec mosquito and a wild one. So the more Oxitec mosquitoes we put into the environment, the more likely females will mate with them and will bring the population right down. It's birth control for insects. What do you think? So you're going to release more mosquitoes to kill us off? <laughs> Are you mad? That just means more bites, more disease. But Oxitec mosquitoes are males, so they can't bite. I'll be able to spot these Oxitec mosquitoes a mile off. You won't, Egypta. They're just like normal males. Well, I will! But you won't. To you, they will be the same as normal males. Who do you think you are? You think humans can outwit me? The humans don't do anything. Oxitec male mosquitoes do all the work. If they're released near you, the males will find you. As you said, it's what they're good at. This is an outrage! Next you'll be telling me Aid is one of them. I've heard enough! Aid! Dengue fever 
is a serious problem. 2.5 billion people are at risk. Oxitec can help.